One, two, three. Perfect. Okay, so the top rows, or the, those are your night nets, right? Yes. Okay, so that's full. So two of uh, my children were diagnosed with primary hypoxaluria type 1. It's an ultra rare genetic disease that is found in the liver, but it affects the kidneys first. Um, there's a process where they don't eliminate the oxalate that their body uh, produces from this mutated gene. And it affects approximately one to three in every million people. So it's very rare. I met Govinda in August of 2020 online and he has primary hypoxaluria type 1 also. He wasn't able to get proper care in Nepal and he wouldn't have survived if he had to stay out there. So we were able to get him and his wife uh, here to America on a humanitarian parole and they've been living with us since June of 2021. Uh, Govinda's on dialysis. At, he's doing home hemodialysis four days a week. And fortunately, Mira, being a nurse, uh, has been trained to provide that dialysis for him. So it provides a better environment for him. And uh, he's still being seen by UCSF. Um, we're trying to get him listed on the organ donor, deceased organ donor list. Uh, everything basically is coming back to their immigration status. You know, there's a lot of difficulties and challenges that come across with things like this, but there's also a lot of blessings that come with it. And that also creates a lot of opportunities uh, to do something about it. My hope, my focus, my goal is to get access and treatment to anyone who needs it, no matter where they are, because everybody deserves a chance and, and every single person matters.